Three students and union members continue their protest against changes to the country's labor laws. The reforms are meant to simplify some of the rules governing the labor market, but critics say it'll remove worker protections, making it easier to fire employees. France's labor minister says it's important to get this right. We aren't carrying out reforms for reform's sake. We're reforming to bring in a new type of relationship between workers and employers and a new project that includes an initiative specifically for employees, and that's essential. Parts of the proposed law have already been watered down, and a parliamentary committee is debating more than 800 amendments, including Article 30. This concerns redundancies. In its current version, a company must show four quarters of economic difficulties before it can let employees go. Another topic of discussion, flexibility in the hours worked. The current text allows for a 12-hour workday in the event of increased activity or reasons related to the business's organization. But the left wing of the Socialist Party wants to see it stay at a maximum of 10 hours a day. And finally, the issue of overtime. Currently, overtime is paid at 25 percent more for the first eight hours and 50 percent more beyond that. The proposal would allow firms the flexibility to negotiate a lower rate of overtime pay. MPs have until Friday to revise the text in committee before putting it to a vote in May.